As presidential hopefuls debate who will keep Americans safer, House Homeland Security Chair Michael McCall has written a book on what the next commander-in-chief could face. I'm telling the American people the truth in this book about what the real threats are. What are the biggest threats? Well, I think they're, they're broad-based, Islamist terror-based. Uh, there's a chapter where they're communicating in the dark space to pull off a, a mall of America shooting a spree. There's a, a dirty bomb scenario coming up. Mexico border hitting the Houston shipping channel, which provides a third of the energy supply for the United States. There's a cybersecurity chapter that brings down the power grid in the Northeast and impacts our uh, stock exchange. These are all very real scenarios that could happen if we don't stay ahead of the threat curve. Like the rest, the Texas congressman is watching the competition to be Americans' protector in chief. Whoever it is is going to need advice uh, on the issue. I, I don't think uh, any of them have. A, a particular strong background. Have you heard anything that has sounded dangerous to you? I think again sometimes the tone and the rhetoric needs to be uh, we need to be responsible. I try to be responsible in what I say because they are watching. And they're seeing Americans increasingly fighting each other. I think Islam hates us and we can't allow people coming into this country who have this hatred. Terrorists want to convince potential recruits there's a holy war. It's also radicalizing what they call losers to lions in the United States to conduct terrorist operations and the message out of Raqqa, Syria is very clear. Come join the fight or kill where you are. Then we need to have a better counter narrative. Changing the narrative is a job McCall believes is best done by religious leaders, NGOs and businesses like Twitter and Facebook that are aggressively rooting out terrorist sympathizers. Get out of here. Go home to mom. The bottom line, knowing who to ban and who to embrace could affect the world's safety oh, for right. years to come. Get out.